Hi Taurus, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Taurus, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Taurus. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Sun card, and this is Leo energy. So this is a very happy, positive energy. This is a card of clarity. Something is being made known to you. Someone could be expressing something to you, some good news here, because this is a very happy energy. So I do see you being happy to find out something here. There's also a feeling of freedom and fun. So there's definitely an energy here of being things going in the positive direction with the Sun card. Okay, so let's see what the rest of the cards have to say. Okay, we have the Knight of Wands, Fire Energy. We have the Five of Cups in the reverse, Water Energy. And we have the Justice card, Libra Energy. So with the Five of Cups, there's an energy of moving on from a dark period because the Five of Cups can really show an energy of being depressed over something, you know, crying over spilled milk, feeling heartbroken, um, you know, being cynical, having a very negative outlook on something because of some sort of perceived emotional loss or disappointment but it's in the reverse which does show it's like you're feeling more confident again feeling optimistic again and recognizing the opportunities that you have so there's an energy of coming out of a dark period and you are entering into a more uplifting positive place and i do see this is coming um after getting some sort of justice because with the justice card and we also have the knight of wands there you could have been dealing with someone who could have hurt you emotionally with the five of cups being there and it's like you're finally able to put that pain behind and um it could be because this person is coming towards you giving you some sort of clarity or truth and you're getting a better understanding or perspective around the situation one that helps you rewrite the narrative in a way that suits you in a way that makes you feel better in a way that doesn't bring you down so there's definitely it's like you didn't know the story fully on that situation and you may have been assuming the worst and that could have kept you in that five of cups energy but it's like this person this knight of wands person is coming towards you with some sort of clarity communication and truth and it is kind of balancing things out for you and this could even be coming with an apology as well but it is giving you the kind of clarity that you can actually um, put some sort of grieving period behind you. Okay, so let's clarify these cards, Taurus. Okay, so we have the page of swords and this is a energy gemini libra aquarius energy so there's something here that you could have had a lot of unanswered questions around and yes it could have kept you feeling negatively it's like the you could have been um really feeling drained by something you could have been overthinking it and even having a cynical view on it but i do see you getting answers you're getting some sort of communication here as well so this is helping you to get out of being stuck in your head. So I'm seeing a lot of communication here. There's definitely something that you were very much overthinking here. Okay, so let's see. Okay, we have the Page of Cups, Water Energy, Six of Pentacles, Earth Energy, and the King of Cups, Water Energy. So someone is coming towards you and is going to make something up to you. Because I do see with the Five of Cups, you, you really could have felt like something wasn't fair and you could have felt confused about it and very hurt and with the six of pentacles and the justice card you will get justice and fairness in the situation someone here they also are acknowledging um that they may have treated you unfairly or that a situation um they didn't handle it in the best way and it's like they're coming towards you with an apology or a peace offering with this page of cups this is someone who is aware and i do see them 
giving to the situation in such a way that they want to help balance out the situation um, and take things to a more I'm seeing this person is going to be more mature when they approach you with this apology or this explanation um, peace offering and uh, I do see that this is someone who actually does care for you but in the past they may have been a bit flighty or selfish immature with that knight of wands energy they could have acted in a way that did a lot of harm to you or caused a lot of harm to you and they acknowledge that and i do see them taking accountability for that um with the king of cups this is definitely someone who it's like they they are coming towards you when they are in a better place emotionally um and i do see them helping you regain some sort of emotional stability because they will be honest with you and i'm seeing apologetic a genuine sincere energy this is someone who's coming to you to balance the scales with you Okay, so I'm going to pull out an oracle card for you, Taurus. Okay, so the card says the end of a tough cycle approaches full moon in Capricorn. So definitely you, you, there's an end of a grieving or a mourning period. There's an end of feeling confused or heartbroken. Um, you are coming out of that dark period. Okay, so I'm going to pull out another card for you. Okay, so the card says new love, a new person has stirred your romantic feelings. Okay, so there's an energy of getting what you need to put in, um, to close the, it's like what you're finally getting here is some sort of justice that's allowing you to close the door on the past and allow new love in. So there could be new opportunities coming in. Um, if this is a new person, this is not going to be a knight of wands type of person. This is going to be a king of cups. There's an energy of getting something better than what you thought you missed out on because the universe has something better for you. Um, you know, there's a karmic energy, karmic rewards here. So definitely there is new beginnings in love here and you're finally able to close something from your past that was heavy on you. Okay, so I'm going to pull out another card for you. Okay, so the card says, determination and creative achievement. You can't use up creativity. The more you use, the more you have. So there's definitely something unexpected about this new love, this new beginning. You may not see it coming, um, but there is also an energy of feeling hopeful again. The sun card can also show some sort of creativity, um, feeling inspired, feeling happy, you know, being in a very energized place after having been so drained by a connection with someone who was very flighty, immature, inconsiderate, self-centered. There's an energy of, um, you know, moving forward away from that energy and attracting better for yourself. There's an energy of that chapter, that cycle, that period where you attract those kinds of low vibrational people is coming to an end. And there's just new beginnings here for you. And I do see it's like you're leveling up in your love life. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Taurus. I hope you have a really, really good day, Taurus. Bye, Taurus.